National Weather Service now confirming it was an official tornado plowing down this residential street. And now a system from California to Maine packing major moisture from the Pacific and Gulf Coast and barreling to the northeast, where millions are still digging out. The new round of rough weather expected to hit Denver hard, and that's where ABC's Clayton Sandell starting us off. March is roaring in like a lion. Millions across the country with barely enough time to dig out before the next round hits. The Big Apple waking up to this today. This New York City street turned into an obstacle course. Similar snowy scenes in Connecticut. And in New Jersey, this car struggling to get traction. In Pennsylvania, icy conditions are being blamed for this 11-vehicle crash on Route 202. These cars total. New England also getting slammed. A half a foot of snow in Boston with more on the way. Some people think that come March, the uh, winter's over. And sometimes March, it comes in with vengeance. And at Bear Paw Scout Camp in Wisconsin, the roof of this building collapsing under the weight of the snow. To the south, the same system spawning an EF-1 tornado in Abbeville, South Carolina. 85 mile per hour winds toppling trees and power lines. This home turned inside out. Tonight, millions from Colorado to Maine bracing as another powerful storm moves in. And Clayton Sandell joins us live now in Denver. And Clayton, two systems colliding over your area, bringing both widespread snow and bitter cold. That's right, Tom. We're just getting the first flakes of snow here in the Denver area, but overnight this area could see up to a foot of snow, even more in the mountains, two feet before this system quickly moves to the east. Tom? Clayton Sandell gearing up for a long night of weather there. All right, Clayton, thank you. Senior meteorologist Rob Marciano standing by in a very snowy central park tonight with the latest forecast. Rob, good evening. Good evening, Tom. I had our first round of snow this morning, but this next storm is moving quickly, pounding much of the west right now. Winter storm warnings are up now uh, for Denver and much of the central plains as it exits the Rocky Mountains with winter storm watches now for much of the northeastern city. So let's time this thing out. The snows will fire across the plains and through St. Louis during the day tomorrow. By noon, we're looking for severe thunderstorms across the southeast. We could see some tornadoes, certainly some damaging winds across the Carolinas and Georgia. Then the snow reaches into D.C., Philly, and New York by 8 o'clock tomorrow night. It does move quickly out of the, that area by the rush hour, but still in Boston for the Monday morning rush. And look at these numbers for a March snowfall. One is uh, th good swaths of three to six, but anywhere from six to 12 just inland. That is a plow.